we're very fortunate here in the Lehigh Valley to have some really homegrown rivalries. One of them exists on the Division Three level, uh, natural, two different cities, the same level, and both doing a great job, both on and off the fields. And getting ready for the Mattia, you know, trophy. And another year, 30th year of the Mattia trophy, and this is the, the first event of the year. Well, another edition of Muhlenberg and Moravian taking place last night, and this time in the sport of women's volleyball. The local rivalry brings a start to the new year, and as the two teams pick up an early season victory, Trey Whitman has that recap. Four and three Moravian playing host to rival in five and three Muhlenberg. In an early season match, both schools were very excited for. The Hounds came out and pounced early, keeping the lead throughout the first half of set number one, as Mary Zacker is able to get up for the kill. But the Mules would come charging back and dominate the latter part of the first set as Shannon Hubert spots an empty part of the court and sneaks the ball there for the point. Another hard kill for the Mules and this late domination was too much for the Hounds to handle as they blow their early lead and lose set number one, 25 to 18. Set number two started a lot like the first with a healthy Moravian run that gave them a six point lead midway through the set. But deja vu as again Muhlenberg is able to battle back and dominate the back end of this set, squeaking out a 25 to 22 win and setting them up nicely for the third set. Third set now and what do you know, another strong start from the Hounds as this serve gives Muhlenberg all types of fits, getting Moravian the easy point. But yet again, the Mules are able to overcome a slow start and fight their way back into the game as Kelly Tornetta hits the Hounds with this game-clinching kill, giving her team a 25-23 third set victory and capping off the overall win in straight sets as they improve the 6-3 and three on the season. That was an exciting win. Uh, they definitely uh, did a great job challenging our block, challenging our defense, and, you know, for us, we definitely... Um, Took us a little longer than I would have wanted for us to recognize some of those things, but you know it was really it was a it was a competitive match. Uh, we've been working over the last couple of days on changing our swings and, and trying to find some different spots to to score. And I thought we did a really nice job of mixing that up tonight. Um, and and really I think we won the match probably from the service line. I think that was huge for us. Um, uh, we had Shannon uh, run. A, quite a few times on some different sets so um, being able to score those runs were huge I think for for us tonight. We started off kind of slow but it was nice to see how we bounced back really fast. I mean we're a really young team so we're still trying to learn how to work together and stuff and we're really coming together really fast so it's really fun to play and really fun to watch. I always think this is such a great match and our girls really look forward to, to playing Moravian and uh, of course we want to win um, and so I think we're the first uh, first this season to get to play uh, Moravian and so for the Maddie Award this is pretty awesome that uh, uh, you know, we got to kind of set the set the bar high and get the win tonight. We're a young group this year, um, but we have a lot of talent, a lot of potential. So I think for us um, at this point, it's, uh, you know, it's growing and, and adjusting and getting a little bit more confident in those tougher matches. So this was good for us tonight to, to get get some get some battles and be tested. And um, we got to see some different players swinging in some different spots. And that was helpful to try to try to figure out what what we have, how deep we are and what we're capable of. So, uh, you know, it, it's a like I said, it's a it's a it's a young group but they're they're fun and they're working hard and that's all I can ask of them. After a tough three sets the Mules are able to outlast rival Moravian and move the six and three on the season. Their next test will come on Saturday against McDaniel. On the scene at Moravian I'm Trey Whitman, two sports. So Muhlenberg leads 1-0 as you mentioned as they mentioned 14-11 and 4 though the series is led by Moravian but Muhlenberg looking for three years in a row to win. Beautiful thing about that for Muhlenberg too is it's a quick ride home and you can get back to your studies as well.